In observance of National Aviation Day, we're going to take a look at 10 interesting engineering facts of aviation. So here we go. How many parts are in a typical commercial airplane? A typical single aisle commercial airliner, such as a Boeing 737 or an Airbus 320, can use up to 1.2 million parts depending on how it's outfitted. Why are planes windows round? High altitude aircraft have round windows instead of square because stresses to the fuselage will flow smoothly through the material. But if an obstacle, like a square window, is placed in its path, the stress has to change direction, causing pressure to build up in the corners of the window. This is called stress concentration, but round windows distribute the stress much more efficiently, creating a much smoother path for the stress to travel. What's the average lifespan of a commercial aircraft? The lifespan of a typical commercial aircraft is not measured in time or miles traveled. Instead, it's based on pressurization cycles. Each time an aircraft is pressurized during a flight, its fuselage is subjected to stress. So the average service life of an aircraft is 75,000 pressurization cycles. Aircraft used on longer routes experience relatively few pressurization cycles in its life and can remain airworthy for longer periods of time than short-haul aircraft. Why no personal electronics during landing and takeoff? It used to be implied that a plane's avionics could easily be compromised by electronic noise from our personal devices. But a plane's onboard avionics equipment must be far more robust in order to handle the extremes of flight. Hence, the real reason we are asked to turn off and stow our laptops, smartphones, and tablets has more to do with them becoming flying projectiles within the cabin in the event of an impact or a sudden deceleration than it does about electrical interference. Can a plane's door be opened in mid-flight? If the door on an airplane were to suddenly open during high altitude flight, it would cause items and people to get sucked out of the plane. But thanks to the engineering characteristics of the door mechanism and the physics of air pressure, this scenario is highly unlikely. Since the cabin is pressurized and airplane doors are plug type doors, meaning that the door is larger than the opening, it would take the combined force of multiple people using all of their strength to even get the door to budge, let alone open altogether. Why don't airplane tires ever explode on landing? One thing you almost never see when an airplane lands is a blowout. That's because a typical commercial aircraft tire can handle loads upwards of 38 tons. The key to their durability is in maximizing air pressure. Commercial aircraft tires are typically inflated to over 200 PSI. That's roughly six times the amount that goes into your car's tires. How fuel efficient is air travel? Large capacity jetliners use less than 3 liters of fuel per 100 passenger kilometers, matching the fuel efficiency of most modern compact cars. How much power can a jet engine generate? The engines of an Airbus A320 can generate enough electricity to power a city of over 60,000 people. Just how indestructible is the black box? A plane's black box recorder stores information on flight control, performance, and audio of the crew's communications that can be retrieved in the event of a crash. These machines can withstand temperatures of over 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit and stand up to impacts 3,400 times the force of gravity and still be able to emit a signal beacon for up to 37 days. Why do modern jetliners have swept wings? Modern jet planes have swept wings to compensate for the localized supersonic air speeds going over the wing, referred to as the critical Mach number. Meaning while you're riding along on your commercial flight at Mach 0.75, the air over the wing could be accelerating to Mach 1 plus, generating supersonic flow, causing shock waves, resulting in a massive increase in drag. But by sweeping the wing, we can delay the supersonic flow and raise the critical Mach number by tricking the wing, making it think it's flying slower than it really is, eliminating the shock waves and the drag allowing for greater control at higher speeds. So there we are, 10 interesting facts to think about on your next flight. Thanks for watching and be sure to like and subscribe.